for a while there, there were certain, it seemed to be certain waves, like maybe a lot of zombie films one year, and then there was an era of a lot of cannibal films. And, Vampire films, and, and yeah, it's um, there was the There was the big women are evil <laughs> phase that right. I, couldn't quite figure out where, where people were coming from. Figuring that one out. Um, my favorite is we had a year that we had two films that came in, both about uh, the nerd who falls in love with a very hot woman who turns out to be a cannibal. He decides he's okay with it and helps her kill people. Two separate films with that exact same premise. Wow, one okay. from West Virginia, one from New York City. And uh, different quality, different directions that they went after that point, but yeah, films. And then I mean one year with Bigfoot, where you had different- well, It's not just one year. Or I should say, well, more than one year. We've had, we've had, three, approaches. we've had three years now in a row, we had Bigfoot movies. Bigfoot film. And I mean, they were all different. I all mean, different. they were approached differently, but- Yeah, and uh, I did not see Bigfoot coming as a, as a thing. <laughs> um, but, uh, and zombie films, everyone keeps, I mean, for years, almost from the first year of the festival, no one thinks that zombie films have any length in them, but zombie films come around, I think, when there's a collective anxiety. Uh, Romero's first one came, at, you know, Night Living Dead came out during the Vietnam War. Right. Um, the ones in the 80s, his sequels and, and the comedies, Return of the Living Dead, those came out during the Reagan years of the real anxiety. And then the whole resurgent came back again after 9-11. Yeah. So there's this, yeah. when you have end of world anxieties, I think zombie stories fit that very well. Um, and you know, I hear all the time, oh, too much zombie stuff, blah, blah, blah. but you know, people are constantly finding new ways, you know, to tell, the, to, to, they need, to tell they these need stories. Subconsciously, I guess we And see, yeah. um, you know, at some point they may go away for a while, but maybe not completely. Mm -hmm.